Hi everyone, JP here. And in this expansion on our flower shop landing page, we're going to look at header tags. If you know what header tags are, you probably know that in Brizzy things are done a little bit different. In most page builders, the heading styles and the header tags are usually combined into one. In Brizzy, they are split. So you have full control over your styling for your headers, and then you can go and set your header tags, or in Brizzy, it's called HTML tags separately. Let's go and fix this and add this to our flower shop landing page. The most important two header tags or HTML tags are the H1 and H2 designations. H1 is like the title of a book, the title of a TV show. So if you have the title, the topic of your site on that page, you give it a H1. But if you don't, you don't give it a H1. In this case, it's just called flower shop. But for example, if this was a specific name like Ivy's flower shop, you will call this H1. And that will be the main thing that Google and other SEO engines will search for when they are looking for what this site is all about. This is a clear indication, H1, this is the topic of this page. And then H2 is like chapter titles, specialties, and um, featured products, what else, custom orders, and maybe get in touch. And then others, the smaller ones, are like sub, sub, subtitles, paragraphs, etc. The H1 and the H2, usually the most important ones. To assign them in Brizzy, let's edit the page with Brizzy. And then you just click on that title, the element, go over here to settings, and you will see HTML tag. And we put this one on H1. All the text elements come in by default with a paragraph designation. So you don't have to worry that it's going to be too crowded in there with too many titles. They're all going to be paragraphs. You have to go and set up your titles. Specialties, I click on this one and I'll call it H2. Mm -hmm. Not going to do that one. You have to be careful what you choose. Don't just choose everything because you know, these engines and, and search engines like Google, they will tell you uh, 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 too many H1s. We don't believe you anymore. This, for example, let's call this a H3. And then art and indoor. Also H3. Custom bouquets, not boutiques. Bouquets H3. And then over here, custom orders. I will make this H2 as well. And this is basically indexing your site. Full collection is not going to be always there, so I'm going to skip that one we deliver and then reach us and get in touch. I'm going to make both of them H2, even though they are in different columns, H2. And there you go. We have assigned our HTML titles and our, what, what do you call it, header tags. And that is done independently from your styling, these guys that we had set over here.